you see him read the title? Um, what if Neptune had all the major moons? Um, what would happen? So, as you can see, I have I have this already set up. Just in case, if something goes wrong, I will save this. If I know how to. Uh, no. How do you save it? Oh, it's right here. Okay. Alright, so what if Neptune had all the major moons? What would happen to Neptune and the moon that's orbiting, orbiting Neptune? I changed that back to light blue. So as you see, I all these different colored lines. The light blue is Ur Uranus's moons, the blue are Neptune's, the orange are Jupiter's, the yellow ones are, uh, are Saturn's, the purple one is uh, Pluto's moon, and the red ones are Mars's moons. And, oh yeah, of course, we have our own right there, the white one. Alright, let's uh, see what happens. We got one orbit kind of wobbling. Speed time up a little bit. Speed up a bit more, like a few months. Oh, Titania. And Callisto, wow, really Callisto. The enemy must have... Uh... What else has really happened? The inner... inner moons are doing okay, but the outer moons, it's just a mess. Ariel is pretty far out. I think that's probably the farthest moon out. What does it take more than that to... Takes wow, two years already. Ooh, Miranda, another moon of Uranus. Man, Uranus is a moon or having a good or having a good time. What does that this take for it? Three years? Alright. Yeah, our moon inner inner moons are still still doing okay. Train's still kinda wobbling. Oh Sharon's this came closer to Neptune. Whoa, Ariel! Oh, Ariel's from now. How long did that take to work with? Five years? Alright. Come on, can we have it, like any collisions? Ariel's a little bit. bit weird. So this can affect the looks like. What really happens? Speed up time again. Ooh. Miranda, whoa! Sell this, whoa! Rhea! Orbits changed a tiny bit. Our moon Oberon and uh, Proteus haven't really changed. Ah, I don't want, I want some collision to happen. I guess Iapetus takes the longest to orbit up to. Six years. So this, so this is the farthest one out. Which probably do, it probably doesn't take as long as Ray to orbit. Yeah, five years. Let's speed this up again. Europa. This is one orbit. Ray is shaking a lot. Train 
Something is getting affected by something. Oberon and, uh, and our moon, so fine. So is Deimos. Wow. Collisions that happen. This is kind of boring just watching. I don't think that's really been happening. It's the moon's orbit's changing. Speed of time. One and a half years. A second now. Ooh. Iapetus! How does that take orbit up to now? Fifteen years. Wow. Who knows? Iapetus may escape Neptune. Also, it may crash into Neptune. No, it's gonna get lucky. Is Iapetus going to be the first moon to escape Neptune? Ooh, Ariel. Is Ariel farther than Iapetus? No, Iapetus still has a farther orbit. Ooh, it's really close now. Is it Ariel or Iapetus? Which one's farther? It's Iapetus, I'm pretty sure. Thirteen years, and I after this takes like fifteen years or something. Wow, it takes twenty seven years. Oh, I this might be at its demise. That's really close, but it's just gonna. Man, Iapetus is hanging on. Iapetus' uh, orbits become more circular again. This is my orbit. Oh. Dione. Wow. Dione's orbit is real weird. Iapetus? Come on. Iapetus has an escape napkin. No, it doesn't. Dang. It's hanging on still. Speed this up. Now we're going two years a second. The inner moon, well, mostly will screw it up, but our own moon, of course. Still, nothing nothing has collided. No, none of these moons have collided with other moons. Man, I was really hoping for some collisions. Oh, oh, look at that. Iapetus. Come on, Iapetus has to escape. Very wait, no, that's Oberon. <laughs> well, Oberon was like the s second closest moon to Neptune. And Iapetus still hanging up. That was uh, that was un unexpected, All right? Oh, well, Iapet, I mean Oberon was ejected. Oh, my Oberon, well, it's been ejected, so I'll just uh, delete it. This is I happen to think it's a lot more circular, I think. Forty years, Jesus. Oh boy, it's going farther and farther out. A hundred years there we go, it's finally escaped. <laughs> it took a very long time. Oh, a moon has been destroyed. The moon has been destroyed, as I as I see. Uh, is this too? Um, I don't know. Ooh, did it? Still have Neptune's moons. Uh, about the Galilean moons. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Are still here. Phobos, I mean, Mars's moons are still here. Celtus orbit. Mm, Celtus may escape. So is Miranda. 
Maybe aerials. I'm sharing the stone here. Uh, I will move stuff here for uh, until. Oh no, that was a uh, umber um Oberon. <laughs> I deleted it. Much happier than. Oh, we're gonna speed up by 10 years a second. Cause nothing's happening. Well, I can only go like six, five or six years. It's not letting me go any faster. Ten minute video. It's pretty long. Come on, Excel just has to escape. I have to escape so it's over on by the lead over on because well but just it doesn't orb orb in the sun either either is it orb in Neptune. Um uh, nothing's happened. So you know what you know what I'm gonna do? Go to here. I'm gonna grab one of my custom gas giants. And see what happens. I need to find my smallest gas giant that I have. Uh, do I still have it? That golem. I'm pretty. Where? Is it here? Is it this? Yeah, I think it is. Yes. All right. Cool. All right, guys. Are you ready for chaos? I have this down. Uh. Purple one. Uh, let's see. Let's make it. Oh, I make it green. Smaller. Think that's green. All right. Let's see what happens. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, holy smokes. <laughs> uh, Try and hanging on. No moons were destroyed. I think Neptune's in a binary with a custom dash on it. Uh, yeah, I guess that that's what would happen. Yeah. Yeah. That's what would happen if you gave Neptune's one of major moons. Well, I guess I'll see you in the next video. Bye.